Hey guys, Freddy Tech back with another video from CFL Tech. I hope you're doing great to start off this video. Now we have a media news story here from streamingbetter.com that will be linked down below. Now this is very interesting about Friendly TV. It says here, Friendly TV subscribers in select markets to gain access to local broadcast stations. Now this is a short list here, about six markets. But still, this is a big step for Friendly TV because they have never been known to have local channels or sports or news. So this is definitely a big step for them. Now, this is uh, networks that are owned by Scripps. This is the company that owns the uh, independent stations that will be on the service as of April 30th. Now it says here, um, the local broadcast stations are currently expected to be added to the Friendly TV channel lineup in each market by April 30th. The six local broadcast stations, five independents, and one CW affiliate. That's interesting. It's a CW affiliate. So that's a good one for that town here, which will actually be um, in the uh, Detroit area. Detroit, Michigan will get the CW affiliate. That's Channel 20, WMYD. Now, this is going to happen, as we said, on April 30th. So it's coming up here real soon. And then you look here now. Uh, Friendly TV made a comment here. This is a significant milestone for Friendly TV. As we built out Friendly TV and added more national channels, the one thing missing was providing our customers with the local prog programming they want and care about, especially local news and popular syndicated content. Now, what are your thoughts on them adding this? Is this a concern? Because now you're thinking, what's the first thing that comes to mind here soon? What will it be? Price increasing you know, price hikes because of the local networks. It's got to cost them something. Now, these are not major ABC, CBS, NBC networks. Those come at a high price. But, you know, it's something that almost had to be done. It appears that, you know, when a company is growing, they have to go to the next level and start offering more. They know a lot of customers are looking for the local channels on one guide. And it's inevitable that this was going to happen. Right now, the rates are still $7.99 to $11.99. So this move is not significant enough to really cause a price hike. But we'll see as they potentially add more cities on here. They are looking to add more networks soon. Probably more scripts, independent networks, which won't cost as much. However, will we start seeing a few dollar price hike here and there? It's possible. Do not ever say never when it comes to price increases with these services. So a very interesting move by Friendly TV. Like I said, almost a necessary move, but also for the current customers, it's possibly a concern as well. But we're still far away from the, from the service being very expensive. So there's a little wiggle room there. But of course, no customer really wants to pay any customer. They don't want to pay more regardless. But if they're getting good content, they might be willing to pay a few dollars more. So what do you think of this? Now, in the meantime here, while you're thinking about that, let's go to the Scripps website here and take a look at what they offer in different cities. Now, these are the networks that they own. So we'll scroll through the list here so you can see if your city's on here. Now, these could be potentially on Friendly TV in the coming months because they're looking to expand further with this. So we'll see what happens. Now, there's Bakersfield, um, you know, some smaller um, markets here, mid-sized markets, uh, Buffalo, New York. Now, some of these may be already mentioned in the six. We have Denver. Um, that's not the, that's the ABC. We have local KCDO. That's in Denver as well. I believe that's one of the channels that's coming on, the, the local three. And you have West Palm Beach as well. They have a couple of stations in West Palm Beach. So here's the list of their portfolio here. It's, pretty, it's fairly impressive. And they have some NBC affiliates as well, some ABC affiliates. So they are definitely no small fry in the media industry, not as big as Nexstar, but you know, they are definitely, they own quite a bit here with Court TV. Um, they own some of the other streaming uh, rights as well. So they have quite a bit in their portfolio. So we'll see what happens with this, with Friendly TV going forward. So what are your thoughts on this with them adding? Is it a concern if you're a cur uh, current customer thinking right away price hikes? And you know, is this a good move for them? What do you think? If it's your first time here on the channel, hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you know when the next video drops. Also lets YouTube know you like the channel and the content. We'll be back more here soon with more videos like this and other streaming content. Freddy Tech will be checking out of this one. Soon to be back with another. Take care.